property and many rely on school to provide basic meals. But in a couple of weeks, students will be out for the summer. Nine Your Science Allie Kramer is going to take a look at the summer meal programs for your children, including one that's accepting registrations through today. Allie. Good morning, Chris. Well, the nonprofit Whole Again, they provide meals, breakfast and lunch for about 2000 kids a day and those numbers, they will skyrocket in the summer and that's why they're partnering with People's Church here in Coryville to provide free breakfast and lunch for every single child that certainly needs it. So People's Church actually wanted to go a little bit further than just providing those meals and for kids in the community for the eighth year in a row, they are offering a summer enrichment program. Kids ages five to 12 can come to a day camp style program from 730 to 5 and that program is kind of different from any ordinary summer camp because it has that emphasis on learning, keeping math and reading skills on point. Program coordinator Annette Dell talked with us and she says it's more about preventing that summer learning loss while keeping kids safe. Studies have shown that when children are not active in the summertime, the nine months that they were in school, they actually end up losing over half of what they've learned. Mm -hmm. And so that's why our goal is to prevent summer learning loss. And we've had parents to come back and let us know that, hey, when their child went back to school in the fall, they actually exceeded when they took that fall test. And that's what we want. Now the program is $100 per child per week. They run, of course, 10 weeks in the summer, but discounts are available. Vouchers are accepted and they have room for about 60 kids. Plenty of open spots still. You can register by simply calling that number you see on your screen. 513-981-0421. We'll post that on WCPO.com as well. And we have looked into the Cincinnati Public Schools. They do a free summer feeding program as well. They're going to have 71 sites and we're told that uh, they'll have some more information on that program in the coming weeks. Reporting live this morning in Coryville, Allie Kramer, Men on Your Side.